Now, breaking news from NBC4. Enormous economic impact for the entire region, and it tends to be a hub. And as we've seen in Oregon, Santa Clara, and Arizona, other companies come alongside as well. So it really becomes a bubbling cauldron of innovation and growth. Project coming to Central Ohio that has potential to change American manufacturing. Intel has picked Central Ohio as the home for its first new manufacturing site in more than 40 years. The $20 billion investment, the biggest investment by a company in Ohio's history. And we thank you for joining us on NBC4 at noon. I'm Brad Johansson. NBC4 continuing to follow this breaking news today. President Biden just wrapped up a press conference discussing that project with Intel's CEO and Ohio senators. NBC4's Alan Henry has been following the story. Alan, what the president have to say this afternoon? Well, Brad, President Biden called today a truly historic investment in America and American workers. This massive investment will also help the historic inflation we've seen in recent months. Commerce Secretary Gina Raimondo says car prices are driving a third of that inflation because there are just not enough chips because of the global chip shortage. But this is about more than just cars and inflation. America used to manufacture nearly half of the world's chips, but that number is just 12 percent now. Now, President Biden says this investment investment here in Ohio will have an impact on nearly every device in every person's life around the world. Be able to say made in Ohio, made in America, it's what we used to always be able to say 25, 30 years ago. That's what this is about. But folks at home might be wondering why it's such a big deal for manufacturing something so small, the size of a postage stamp. Why is that so important? Well, semiconductors are small computer chips that power virtually everything in our lives. Your phone, your car, your refrigerator, your washing machine, hospital equipment, the Internet, the electric grid, and so much more. In a statement announcing the news this morning, Governor DeWine also said, quote, Today's announcement is monumental news for the state of Ohio. Advanced manufacturing, research and development and talent are part of Ohio's DNA. And we are proud that chips which power the future will be made in Ohio by Ohioans. Now, Intel CEO is leaving the White House soon and getting on a plane with Senator Portman and Senator Brown heading here to Central Ohio. They'll be joining Governor DeWine and other leaders from across Central Ohio to discuss how this investment is going to change the region. And of course, we're going to have team coverage both here on air and online.